Hi guys, so today we are going to Target. I don't know how much I'm gonna film in the store as I heard that they're doing like their massive uh, New Year's kind of clearance sale. It usually starts after Christmas and they put all the Christmas stuff on sale. I did go there a few days ago and they had some stuff 70% off in the home aisle. I'm hoping that that stuff is down to 90% off now. It's been about five days um, and see if I can get some more deals. I got a really awesome throw blanket from there and if they have them on sale for even cheaper, I will definitely invest. So crossing our fingers hoping we get some good deals we're gonna see what they have and then we're gonna do a haul I'm super excited because I love Target and I love shopping their year-end like clearance sales or their New Year's sales they always do really good clearance and they move shit quick so it goes down super super quick so I usually wait and go when it's like 70 to 90 percent off I never usually mess with it when it's anything less than 70 percent off so I'm excited to go and see what they have So far we are hitting the jackpot. I got this cute sweater. And then I got this sweater too. I spent less than $10. This is great. So I didn't really film in there as much as I would have liked to, but it was busy. Like the parking lot was full when I went in there. And when I first walked in, the checkout line wrapped like all the way around the front. And I went back into toys and I was like, oh my God, am I even like, do I even want to shop here? But I did some shopping and by the time I was done, there was no line. So I was out, but I got so many good things and I'm super excited. They're all stuff that's useful. I don't think that I bought anything because it was just a good price. It was really picked over. They didn't really have too much stuff. Like they really didn't have any Christmas stuff, but I did get uh, two ornaments that I wanted. Um, not necessarily like designs that I liked, but I wanted, so I'm super excited about those. I got some other stuff, which I'll show you guys in a haul when I get back, but I wish I could have got more footage. I should have taken some pictures of the signs for a thumbnail, like obviously, but it was a lot. There was a lot going on in there and I'm just so excited that I got some really good okay, stuff. so I'm back from Target and I thought that I would show you guys what I managed to pick up and tell you how much I paid for everything. First off, I got this sweater. So you guys know in my last like Target haul I did, I got a bunch of sweaters. So they had this one and it's a really pretty like brown, pink, and red kind of stripe. Super, super soft. It's got a little bit of like the extra fuzz on it so you guys can see it's so nice and this was originally $29.99 and it was on sale for $8.99 such a good deal and then the other clothing piece I got you guys saw already as well um, but it's this really crazy like cardigan and I'm like really into it I don't know if I can pull it off I think I can I just don't know if I'm just gonna wear like a regular tank top or like maybe like a um, tube top underneath or something. I love this like color, this coral color here. And it's covered in these like velvet bows and it's so soft. It's so cute. This one doesn't have a clearance sticker on it. They literally only had one of these. It was a size small, but it was originally $27.99 and it was 90% off. It was with the Christmas sweaters, which they only had like one Christmas sweater. So this was only $2.79. And I think that's a steal, even if I only wear it like once or twice. All right, moving on to the kind of miscellaneous stuff that I got. I found this going to the home section. They had an end cap full of these all different colors like baby pink baby blue yellow white cream black green red like literally every color and more um but only two of the colors were on clearance this one and then like an olive one and typically i would go for an olive because i love green but I thought that this color would work really well with the carpet in my room. Letter board from The Room Essentials. And this was on clearance for $4.50 and it was originally $15. And then in the back it comes with all the letters and the symbols and everything. So I think I'm going to have this put up on my shelf here. I used to always film in front of this window. Recently I've been filming in this uh, chair here though and um, I always had this up. But I feel like this just isn't my style anymore. I'm a little more grown than this. So I'm excited to have this. I think it's a little more 
like home decor -y, and I think it will just look better in my office. Then I got two things in the Christmas aisle. Um, all of that stuff was 90% off, so uh, all the ornaments were like 30 cents. And I went in there because I wanted one that said 2020. This was the only one that they had that said 2020 on it. I wanted a picture frame because there's already one on our tree that says 2019 and it has a picture of Cinder with Santa in it. So since we have Evie this year, I wanted to get one to put a picture of Evie and Cinder in for 2020. And this is the only frame that they had. My mom thinks it's a mouse. I thought it was a bear. I'm not exactly sure, but it's kind of weird looking, but it's cute at the same time. It was literally the only one that they had that said 2020. I don't really care. It was literally 30 cents. I'm not going to complain. It says nice list VIP and it's kind of like a red house. And then you just put the photo in here and you hold it with this little magnet. The magnet is kind of scratched up, unfortunately. So the snowflake's like a little kind of weird, but I think it's okay. So it just magnetizes anywhere on here and it will hold the picture. So I thought this was really cute as well. The last three things I got in the makeup section. I did see this at the very bottom, like kind of stuck in the corner, and it is a Lashes for Days little two-pack, and I like it. I think they look very natural. I like that it doesn't have the black band, and these were originally $5. I don't even know what brand this is. It's just put out by Target, and this was 90% off, so it was 50 cents. So 25 cents for a pair of lashes. I feel like you can't really go wrong. Like, even if they're not the best, I feel like it's okay. Like, I can wear them once and just throw them out for that price. If they had more of these, I might have picked up a few more, but they only had the one. Lastly, they had a lot of stuff in the um, makeup aisles on clearance, like just with their regular stock. And these, ever since I started doing makeup, have always been my favorite brushes. I don't know what it is about them, but I love them, and they are my absolute favorite. And the only place you can get them, I think, is at Target, and they're typically pretty expensive. I think I got the last of each one of these styles, but it is the Sonia Kashuk. I'm not exactly sure how you pronounce her name. I am so sorry, but they are, first off, beautiful brushes. They're like this very pale pink color with this rose gold right here before the brush tip. They are so stunning. They are so soft. It's like a very soft matte. I love these so much. Style 27, which is a crease brush. Super excited about this. And then 22, which is just a tampered blender. I'm super excited about these. And these were on clearance for $3.50 a piece. That's everything that I got. I think I did pretty good. I think I had a lot of self-control. I really wanted to get some jewelry, but the jewelry just wasn't cheap enough yet. And your girl spent $24. $24. At Target. And then I got another $1.20 off with my red card. Thank you guys so much for watching. Go check out your local Targets because they're having a lot of really good sales and you can find some really good stuff. So, highly recommend. I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you again very, very soon. Peace out, Girl Scouts.